Brussels has been accused of weaponizing peace in Northern Ireland with its claim that goods crossing the Northern Ireland border would put the integrity of the entire single market at risk. The latest data available shows only 0.2% of goods imported into the bloc cross the boundary between the Republic of Ireland and the six counties. The figure flies in the face of dire warnings coming from Eurocrats for months, suggesting the bloc's single market would be undermined if checks on goods traveling from Great Britain to Northern Ireland are not carried out. The EU argues that such measures are necessary to ensure no unauthorized product ends up in the Republic, a member state. But the likelihood of this happening is slim, as official figures show. According to Facts4U.org, 99.8% of all the goods imported into the EU in 2019 the most recent year for which data is available, did not cross the boundary from Northern Ireland, a report by the website titled Exposed, How EU Has Weaponized Peace in Knee Over 1 500th of EU's Goods Imports said, put simply, the integrity of the EU single market is not at risk from goods crossing the knee border. 99.8% of all EU's goods imports do not cross the border from Northern Ireland. Ireland. This is and has always been a bizarre, manufactured, and completely implausible argument used by the EU to punish the UK for leaving, by annexing part of its territory. Last month Brandon Lewis, the Secretary of State for Northern Ireland, hit out at Brussels for ordering unnecessary checks on foods that are not destined for the Republic. He pointed to checks being carried out on Sainsbury's goods, despite the supermarket giant having no store below the border. He said the rules meant businesses are having to grapple with a burdensome regime of checks and processes.